often it's said that this gentleman is one of the best at this company. He boasts to be exactly that. And at one point in time, Ty, we considered him the heart and soul of this company. Not sure where that went. Well, you know, I, I, I thought he was, yes, I agree, the heart and soul. He had some bad stuff happen to him last year, and I guess it kind of changed the way he feels about you know, where he's at and what he's doing in the in the wrestling business. He feels like he should be on top of the world. And now, it is like he's just ready to take it. He's not ready to, he's not waiting for anything to be given to him. It's hard. Oh, wow. Now that's just straight that's disrespectful. Come on, buddy. Well, that aside, this is all over Sawyer, ladies and gentlemen. His opponent is this gentleman. Oh yes! Pure heart! Grab what? Quite possibly the new heart and soul of Firestar Professional Wrestling. Being followed in the ring by one Elliot Shock, the Shock Master! Of course, Grant Watts, as we always say, is one of the best students that has ever come through this school. It can be argued. Also, what can't really be argued, he is the most famous guy we know on TikTok time. Oh, yes, the most, <laughs> most famous on Instagram and TikTok out of the Firestar group, man. And, of course, Grant is very much suited for these types of battles. He oh, has yes. a very technical style. Yes, very ground and pound, very, very like Zack Sabre Jr., yes. Brian Danielson type stuff, Samoa Joe, just... Hard grappling, hard, you know, wrestling. Dustin Meadows, tell us about it. Hey! Out of the way, from Cary, North Carolina, weighing in at 185 pounds, pure dragon, Oliver Sawyer! Pure, pure like rules, pure heart, pure dragon. This is gonna be an amazing fight. That's exactly what this is gonna be. This Absolutely. is gonna be a fight, okay? Pure Here heart, we go. pure dragon. Round one, it's like the 1980s. It's the battle of the pures. Right now, Grant Watts against Oliver Sawyer. Two technicians, both of them. I said that Grant Watts is suited for this match, but Maybe if the opponent wasn't Oliver Sawyer. I agree. Listen, you know, both these guys are probably the most technically... Oh, no, oh, 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 oh straight out the hit. gate. Two. Oh, and he got oh, a three. Oh, 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 wow. Right out the gate. Grant Watts wasting no time. A pin that took place within 29 seconds of the start of this round. That was quick, man. I didn't even try to get my thought out. That happened so fast. He just come out of nowhere with that. And we'll see if we even get a third round. But this is round two. Oliver's already won down. Now they take lock a series. Oh, uh, now I remember what I was gonna say. These guys, these guys are you know top marks here at the Firestar Pro Wrestling Academy. If we want, if the, the two top technical guys in Firestar be these two guys right here. Oh, pure wow. heart, pure dragon. Oh, and Oliver looking for a cover. Two. two. These Mike guys two. always training, always training for, for new ways to put holds on somebody, to twist limbs, That's to pin somebody. Shut up. You really want me to deal with you again? You really want to lose again? And of course, oh. Elliot Shock and Oliver Sawyer have a bit of history. Corey, we've got to care for these corner men. Jackson Drake, the corner man for uh, Oliver Sawyer. We'll see him in action later tonight against LeBron Cozy. Yeah. Meanwhile, headlock takeover by Oliver yeah. Sawyer, looking to work some of his ability on Grant Watts, who caught him by surprise earlier. No shoulders, no shoulders. Now Grant working his way up. 
gentlemen, particularly Oliver, has one minute and 45 seconds left in which to work. Take down here, Oliver into a Casey Katama position or a side headlock control, however you would like to call it. Oh, look at what he's... Did you see that? Kip up as he scooted under him, a squirm. Oh, no. Oh, but he and kept a leg. Back to back, these gentlemen can't keep each other down. Oliver, Watch it. He can't do the closed fist. Yeah. That is against the rules here at Ring of Sport. No closed fist. No toe kicks. No throat chops. Grant. Wow. This is a fast pace. Oh, oh, there oh, he is. Is. Goodness gracious. Put Randy Orton on notice with that one. Somewhere the Viper is smiling the biggest smile of his life. As his grandson. Grant Orton just power slammed him almost through this ring. Look at that, just up, oh, down, Grant. over, through. He picked him up, puts him back down, he's gonna do it again. He's got deep Japanese arm drags here. As he just rolls him over right to a pinning combination, but now chicken switches wing. it. Chicken wing is going over one. Oh! Mike says just a one count. Oliver Sawyer seeking a sabbatical on the outside, away from Grant Watts. However, this will force Mike Goga to initiate the 10 count. Oh, wow, Jackson Drake! What the hell was that? What the hell do, what just happened? Oh, and a backdrop roll oh to the God. apron. And that's the end of the round. Jackson Drake got away with one there. Oliver Sawyer just got a public warning for fighting on the outside. Jackson Drake having a couple of choice words with Elliot Shock, but that is simply because Elliot taking offense to what Jackson just did very blatantly in front of all of our eyes, Todd. That was ridiculous. He took advantage. Yeah. Referee yeah. turned back and just clocked him. These gentlemen will get now 15 seconds to rest, regroup, and come back. Great Watts looking like 15 seconds isn't enough. Got Mike Goga ready to call for it. And here's the round, and oh my god, good! Flying feet trigger just hit the left mandible of Grant Watts! Good lord! And Grant He's Watts, counting them out, man! Grant Watts' eyes are in the back of his head almost! And he's up! He's up! And okay! Mike Goga almost getting into business on that one! And Grant oh, Logan oh, snap no. dragon suplex by Oliver Sawyer. Cover here to get a fall. And Grant Watts says no. So close. Coming out hot starting round three with a V trigger. Now Oliver looking for wrist joint manipulation hey, hey, here. Hey, 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 if he gets that's a public warning. It is He's already got the one. Worst. Yes. He got one for fighting outside. You can't do small joint manipulation. And now he's stepping right on the neck of Grant Watts. And, oh god, right on the back. And that's right on the cervical. Jesus. I know how that feels. I've had a herniated cervical disc. That stuff is no joke. Had nerve pains shooting all down your arm. And just a near 200 pound man dropping his knee across your neck like that. Now Oliver just relentless on Grant Watts like a piranha. Again, he has one minute and 42 seconds with which to work. Oliver Sawyer, one fall down. Trying to figure out a way to hit what well, he I guess he has figured out a way to kind of get back on level with Grant Watts, and that's with the help of his corner man, Jackson Drake. Jackson Drake, definitely a great corner man. If any other corner man could do something like that, I feel like Oliver Sawyer would be undefeated. Whoa, did you see those jaw breaker. draw breakers? That's innovative. And now a drop toe hold before he turns up. Look at Grant. Oh, oh God! Oh my God! Grant Watts, that was remorseless. Stiff necking. That was a move from Mortal Kombat. And now Grant with a front headlock and he's looking for a neck breaker. Oh, good Lord. That's a close fist. Well, that was a forearm actually. Almost. 
Oh, and now Grant returning the receipt with a forearm, but let's do it flying style, he says. Now he's looking for a neck right there. Cashes that bet. Can he cash the victory? Now Mike Goga starting the count. And now Grant, can't break it. he can't break it. Oh, wow. Was right that open? left mandible. That was an open palm strike to and the now face. now he's got a sleeper hold in on Grant Watts. Mike Goga didn't even have time to tell him about the open palm, or about the close palm strike. Grant Watts, out. Oliver Sawyer. Mike Goga cleaning house saying that there was public warnings in both ways. He just didn't get a chance to do it, but doesn't much matter. Oliver Sawyer is going to get a victory or, or, or fall in his, in, his, in his column. And then Grant Watts obviously has to fall in his column from the first round. So here we are. We got round, round number six. Round four. Or sorry, round four. Round four here. I forget the round, the round four. And Grant's one fall apiece. Uh, Oliver Sawyer with two public warnings. Grant Watts with one. Good Lord. And we're starting. We're going to turn each other's chest red, beat red. Oh, that's a thud. That is not a slap. That means that one shook hearts. Chicken thighs right there, right? Oh, no one here. And now Grant gets one back, too. How about we make it a hat trick? Grant Watts with hat trick. Chest slaps. And now, Mike. He's got to wait. He's got to get him up. He's got to get up before he can fight him. Mike says, keep going. And now Grant steps right up to a chop delivered by Oliver Sawyer, who gets a chop right back, receipt style before he goes ahead and says, you're it. This is the most intense and painful Overhand. game of tag ever. Tag, you're it. Absolutely. You don't want to be hit in this ring, though. Where's base? And Grant coming down to his knees on that, which will force Mike Goga to account. Oh. oh my goodness, Oliver a little bit worried. He's got his oh, two public wow. warnings. Oliver took a second shot. Four, five, goodness gracious, Grant taking about the same amount. And Oliver on the fourth one sent him straight to the ground. And these gentlemen right at, back at it, two bulls. Bulls striking horns, oh! He's, he struck, he, uh, he duked him out. Oh, wow. Duked him out. Good Lord. Let's put a chop where a lariat should have went. You see the vessels popping in the chest of both of these men. The handprints on them. Jackson Drake's face is all of us right now. Jackson in the in the in Oliver's corner trying to get him back up. And that was hellacious. Single leg takedown oh! here. Oliver says, I gotta give now, you one that back. That was just straight up disrespectful. A down, an axe like chop while on the ground. Oh my God. Oh, good Lord. We got 30 seconds. That's all this round has been. It's just straight up chopping the crap out of each other. And now both men down with chops, and they've got about 16 minutes to figure it out. Mike Goga approaching Quattro. Cinco. We're at the count of five. Ty, I'll give you English, I'll tell you the Spanish, buddy. And that's the end of the round. Saved by the bell. Pretty good quite, show. Quite, quite, pretty good. Quite literally, these men saved by the bell. I'm not sure they were able to gonna answer that tank count. And these gentlemen here are, they find themselves in quite a war time. Oh, yes. This, th there are battle wounds of plenty. Grant Watts is coming out stumbling like somebody's grandpa at a function where they've gotten a little too much to drink. I just heard Elliot Shock come over here and said, Grant, your chest is bleeding. 
And here we go, round five. And these gentlemen coming right back to the center, right where they left off. Going straight for it. This is a hockey brawl. And I'm a flying knee. Oh, return back. Step up knee here with the lariat. The Oliver Sawyer puts him down. Oh, and Grant look stands up. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Oh, good Lord. That elbow. And a step up in Seguri to boot. Oliver. City boys down. Oh, he's going to go for it. Oh, no. German. Oh, no. German suplex by Pure Heart, Grant Watts. Hey, and that suplex took some Pure Heart. Jackson Drake just pulled Oliver out of the ring. He just pulled him, he probably just saved, saved him real quick. Jackson Drake utilizing the rules to his advantage. Oh, goodness gracious. Whoa, Oliver Sawyer. Head into the damn apron, just like he did Elliot Shock. We gotta get somebody to check on Grant. Elliot down, Grant down, hand down, man down. We're all down. Good lord. All this over a disqualification that could have been prevented by not having to do his own actions in which he participated in. I don't understand it. Somebody's gotta check on Grant Watts here. Like he literally he drove. Throw his head into the side, that steel apron. Steel berry, steel bar is underneath. 